This morning is a bittersweet one for many Iowans. It would have been the first day of the Iowa State Fair. You can almost hear those animals mooing and oinking. The fair is postponed until next year because of coronavirus. But our Tommy Clark has been a sleuth this morning on the fairgrounds. You found some action, right? Yeah, so we were on the other side of the fairgrounds where the Grand Concourse is. That remains empty. But we did find this side of the fairgrounds where the junior livestock shows they are on. They're just spaced out over a few weekends. And of course, we're still missing those traditions like, you know, the foods and everything that we enjoy. But just because we'll have to wait till next year for them doesn't mean we have to miss out on all the fun. So for the next 10 days, Iowans can visit the State Fair's website or Facebook page for videos, competitions, facts and games. And we will bring you flavors of the fair each morning. Every day we'll have a different theme and you can participate with us on our page. We caught up with the CEO of the Iowa State Fair, Gary Slater, and he was telling us they're cre getting creative to bring pieces of the fair back right now. That includes what we just showed you, holding junior livestock shows spread out over multiple weekends. I know that Iowans are missing the Iowa State Fair. A lot of people are sad because this is their annual family vacation and some of the things that they normally do uh, we're on hold uh, but we are here we are planning the fair for next year uh, we we'd like your support he says that next year is going to be bigger and better in 2021 but for now you can get involved with the virtual iowa state fair on whether their facebook page or kcci's page Today is the do-it-yourself butter cow, so you can submit a creation, put it on Facebook, and we may show it this morning. That goes through the 23rd. For now, live at the fairgrounds, I'm Tommy Clark, KCCI News, I was News Leader. All right, thanks, Tommy.